Amen. So apparently shooting has got extremely easier. The last and final patch of 2K24 is coming soon. I already got it scripted out, man. Mike Wang is literally telling us I'm going to decode it and break it down. We got to go over some Zenner clips to see if Zens are back in his prime. Xbox is saying that it packed Zens. I'm going to give you the real information about that. Mike Wang is admitting to never tuning the game for the top 5%. So all y'all that blame YouTubers and comp players and all that, you're a liar and you live in delusion. Everything I've been saying is actually the truth. But because of your time, because of the, the times you were raised in, you want to fight the truth. You want to fight for your era, but your era is weak, boy. And it's time you come to reality. Don't take it offensive. Let me teach you. Walk with me. Let me lead you to the truth. You want to be lied to on a video game? You want to listen to these damn liars? These creators, these negative win percents, these Reddit users, these goddamn tweeters? It's time to wake you up. Accept the truth. Dear Mike Wayne, I see you debating on shooting. Please read. No one wants the game to be NBA Live. This is a negative win percent casual, okay? So negative win percent casuals are saying this and so are the upper echelon of 2k players but mike wang is steadily making 2k more like live the negative win percents and the top echelon we really have more in common dude than y'all think a lot of y'all blame the top upper echelon for the game being horrible when you don't realize the reason you hate the game is not because of the skill gap of it being too high it's because the game's broken but you're not realizing it you need to direct your anger towards the devs not the upper echelon okay they don't listen to us they make the game casual they believe making a game for 95 percent of the user base is the way to go they think 95% of the user base wants a casual game, but this isn't true because everyone knows who's actually played the games of the past. Those were skill gap games, not casual games, and every 2K player that actually played them believes they are better 2Ks. So that literally means the casual fan base wants a higher skill gap game, but they just don't know it. But anywho, he says, but also the average working person doesn't want to come home and struggle to do basic stuff. This is true. And I can agree with that. You see, I don't want to make this just straight copy. But look, what, what people aren't realizing. Walk with me. Walk with me. Listen, listen. If you make a game too easy, very easy, it's chaos because there's no order. That's why the best players have to lock in versus bots. There's no order. Without structure, without order, you have complete chaos. And even the casual person, bro, despite what y'all think, the basketball community is very tryhardy. They're very, they think they're great. They're very tryhardy compared to other communities, right? So they're trying to constantly get better, right? They're gonna eventually realize, yo, this hoe don't make sense. Even though I did this input, I'm not getting this output and it's gonna frustrate the gamer, right? But they don't know why they're disliking the game, bro. They blame it on the, the upper echelon when the game's just broken and it's too casual. Look, shooting wide open in the corner shouldn't be tough. Facts, it shouldn't be tough. But guess what? The reason casuals and comp players be missing in the corner because the game's fundamentally broken. It's not that it's hard. It's that it's broken. Do you not understand? You're getting random releases. That means it's broken, bro. You're getting random ghost contests. You're getting slowed down speeds. You're getting sped up speeds randomly that you can't predict. The game is broken, bro. <laughs> it's broken. It's not that it's too hard, bro. It's that it's broken. Dudes lying say that they want comp facts, but in reality, they want 2K to help them for not playing defense. Mm, let's, 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 let's go on. How are we arguing that shooting should be hard? No, shot contests need to work. Facts. Shooting should, it has to have some type of, you know, you know. But what it should really be is the defense being played on you. You, if you're like wide open, you should have a much easier time hitting your shot. 
I'm not talking about these pocket shots. Oh, he didn't put his hand up. Uh, I'm talking about if you wide, boy, bro, and you got your ratings, your badges, and you got a decent timing, that should be butter. <laughs> butter cheese biscuits, my boy. Honey on the side, okay? But the game is broken. <laughs> You not understand it. It's, but look, look, I'm going to show you more information that shows you that Mike Wang is admitting to not catering to the top percent. I've been telling y'all since 17, that's when they really started to cater to the negative 1% casual. And when you do that, like I tell y'all, you have chaos. You feel me? Where people can compete that should never be able to compete because the game's just unpredictable. But look. Look, he says we already had to pick the shots based on stat, da da da. But now I'm forced into this science of shot stability. Height, da 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 da. It's already too much and it isn't fun. This is what I'm telling y'all. But these creators with these big voices, right? They are lying, saying that casuals like 2K24. This is not true. The only people claiming that they like 2K24, 2K23, are the envious okay listen and if it's you it's you bro you, you gotta move past envy bro I'm not, i know it bleeds in other elements of your life the only people that truly like this game are the people that are envious of the upper echelon and they are loving these comp players complaining on their twitter their youtube and not liking the game that is their sole reason. If none of this existed and they played, they would not like this all. Guys, I post on Instagram. I've been posting on Instagram, getting like 8 million views a month. I see thousands of comments of negative win percent casuals roasting the game. But these people keep saying that casuals like the game. Even some comp players are falling into that illusion. No. If, if y'all not understand it, we have to say the casuals don't like the game if we want change because they are the majority. You look under any post in 2K, straight hate. Any post YouTube comments of uh, 2K, straight hate, right? Guys, this game is not liked. On Tiki Top, dog, I get over a million every month for for like a good year right they're roasting the game i get hundreds of comments they dis uh, most of my viewers are casuals bro right when i go on twitch when i see any twitch stream most of them they dislike this hoe right so the truth is majority of 2k does not like the direction that 2k is going in right they just don't know why i know why you need to listen to me, okay? 2K has leaned way too much into the comp thing, and I do not care about comp dudes. Guys, this is the least, this is the most casual. Listen, listen, listen. 24, 23 are like the most casual 2Ks ever, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah. But y'all think that they're making it comp, but all comp people are telling you this hoe is very casual. Listen, they on the game. They know what they're talking about to some extent. I'm telling you, everything is going more casual. You do, do not understand? That's why you don't enjoy it. The answer to making a fun 2K is not casual. The answer to making a fun multiplayer game is not casual, bro. Because people are tryhards. We want to be better than everyone else. Even though, you know, we're playing every now and then. Bro, if you learn... On, on shooting games, if I got high ground, I'm gonna be beaming these people. You get up to high ground and you're getting smoked. It's gonna make you mad because you're gonna feel helpless. So when you learn these different type of things, bro, and it's not working, right? Because the game's broken, because it's so casual based that anyone can do anything at any time, you're not gonna be happy. This is what developers aren't understanding, bro. You must come to the side of the swan. Look. I do not care about content creators. I do not care about jobless sweats. 2K needs to return to being fun. 2K14 PS4 ver version easily. Bro, 2K14 was one of the greatest 2Ks ever. Bro, that's top three, my boy. It's probably top two of the part 2Ks. 
bro listen listen i am more sweaty than anyone in history bro the skill gap was immense you might not have known but the skill gap between 14 through 16 was way higher than every 2k after bro i'm telling you okay i'm telling you <laughs> okay i've been trying to get them to go back to the days okay then casuals and comp guys alike will enjoy it but they think eliminating and creating this slow molasses anyone can do anything broken game okay the, the, the game's just broken but besides the the fundamental gameplay the game's fundamentally broken on so many levels like it's just like it's it's just broke i don't like you you feel me <laughs> i'll just tell y'all true y'all you can play it nah, bro hey we pay 100 a bill bro i'm just trying to get a better game so i can enjoy it we all can enjoy it bro you feel me but look and i still revisit revisit it annually look bro i be posting this bro and look those dribblers y'all hate the comp players that y'all hate the creators y'all hate the ones that played 14 they love 14 they want the game to be like 14 and you want it to be like 14 the casual negative win percent but they're not making it like 14 who are they making it for that damn sim nation envious bot you feel me the ones that should have stayed on nba live why are you trying to make 2k nba live there's a reason 2k destroyed live but now they're making this live do you not get it look i decided to not buy 2k24 for a multitude of issues but shooting has grown way too complicated this generation time to chill out look and baluba says this this basically means he's going to make this whole easier i'm going to show you more evidence of that and you know this six days ago so he's definitely he's he's tired of people complaining i think in his mind he's just going to make this whole easy on all levels and i, I think maybe just if he really has the power to really do it between the sliders of the game i think with park and all that he's gonna try to make that as easy as possible the play now and uh maybe not as easy as 2k22 he might do it I, I i think he's gonna eventually go that route guys i'm telling you their ultimate goal okay i am a brainiac on this whole listen the ultimate goal of 2k is to make shooting as easy as 2k22 which is the easiest shooting 2k ever 2k22 could have been a way better game if the shooting wasn't that easy right but they want to make the shooting that easy for all the negative wimp the the majority fan base but if they make it that easy the top five percent are gonna go bananas and they don't want that right they do not want that because then the game looks crazy like that left right in 22 looked way crazier than it actually was because of the shots you could make because it was so easy because they were catering to the casual that they allowed a, a rare player to go bananas right they're trying to find a way and that this is why i'm telling you there's stuff in the game that limits certain players like ever since 2k23 small bills can't shoot as good as bigger builds bro and this is not no placebo oh he, he uh, you, you get to see his release? No, they implemented something to hold those players down with those high ratings and all those extra badges. They implemented something to where bigger players, which more casuals, and they shoot bigger builds, shoot better than smaller builds, bro. It's just a fact, dog. It's a fact. They know most skilled players go with smaller wingspans. Smaller wingspans, they have a way harder time than shooting with longer wingspans, bro. I know what I'm talking about, bro. Like... <laughs> I'm telling you, dog, and Mike Wang's already admitted to RNG. I'm telling you, dog, I've already... Look, listen to this. Mike Wang is responding to another negative 1% Reddit user. Most players have a life, a career, families to provide for. A few hours a week to have fun on this game. We do not have time to be more consistent than Matt, okay? And he's responding to this, right? He's going to make this whole easy. He's done being bashed by the casuals, right? So y'all let me know if y'all are excited for this. But look, this is what he says. Listen, guys, listen, I've been telling you. The reason you don't like the game is because it's broke. They are like not good developers, bro. I'm telling you, it's broke. And making it too casual 
makes it too chaotic for you, bro. Okay, look, we don't tune the game for the top five percent. Do you, do you, do you see that? Okay, but we do need to consider. He's saying that to, you know, not get get the attack. But look, we regularly analyze shooting telemetry across all users and modes. And despite what some of y'all think, the stats are pretty close to desired target. Play now online, da 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 da. That's why I was adjusted today. So he made that hole harder. Very close, maybe three to five percent how I like them to be. Okay. Now look, let's see what this dude has to say. This is very reading the replies under Mike's recent comments really shows our ignorant some people are resorting to insults and disrespectful remarks to a man that isn't required to respond to anyone. Yes, he is. We are paid customers. Shut up. <laughs> Stop double twisting these damn devs. We are paying customers that they are not giving us a good enough product for how much we pay. Let's stand up for ourselves, man. Listen. He can simply make the game, make his money, and not give you a lit. No, he needs us. <laughs> he needs us. Lick of attention. Like, we should be honored. No, boy. <laughs> we pay for this. Fix the game. Make it better. You're doing a horrible job. Guys like this, y'all need to X out, dog. You need to flame people like this. Stop letting people get away with it. Then he says, but he and other devs choose to discuss the game with you because they know the back of how we feeling. Then he says, also quit blaming 2K for the predatory VC practices. That's take two's fault. No, listen, listen, guys, listen. Let me let me tell y'all something. We can't contact take two, right? They're not acting. So how we get felt is going at them. You feel me? Someone has to feel it. It's not just, oh, hold your tongue. He don't have no control over that. You know, and even with the Ronnie guy, I used to be like, man, he don't do nothing. He's just the, the face, right? But no, however you feel about the game, let them know, dog. I mean, you might get blocked, so be smart about it if you don't want to get blocked, right? 2K, you could kind of be a little crazier under they stuff, but the devs, you know, you could call out the game, flame them for it, but you know, just try not to get blocked so you can keep voicing your, your thoughts. But look, VC, flame them, dog, because it has to get felt so they see it. If y'all aren't going at the media, the, the true person isn't going to feel nothing because we can't reach them. You understand? So you got to reach who you can. Okay. And this is the same thing in life. 2K would communicate more if the community would be more respectful. Listen, who cares if they communicate or not? Okay. This has been years, my boy. I've, I've, I'm talking to devs directly. Devs follow me. Right. And I'd be talking crazy, but they know that. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. I got a voice. And you know, I'm telling y'all right now that communicating with them, it don't it don't do nothing, bro. So you got to push it further, man. Or you're not going to get what you want, okay? This little we don't need to talk to them. They need to talk to us to make a better product that we're spending money on. You feel me? Delayed greens, dopamine spike. Yeah, I agree with that. But look, Baluba, he he's saying he wants he likes this but no, we, we're, we're not going down that. When, when y'all make these people feel pressure, they feel pressure to make the game better, okay? Now look, apparently Xbox is doing something to fix Zens, but I'm hearing that this is not gonna fix anything. Um, he says Xbox will stop unauthorized accessories from connecting to Xbox consoles starting in November and will display an error message to users using such accessories. Now I'm I'm hearing uh through like reading these comments that they're just going to find another update firmware to fix it. Hopefully they just keep updating it to fight back and uh but I also read that PlayStation's been doing this and they still always find a way. Um y'all y'all geeks in the watching the video, y'all y'all let me know if there is a possible way that they can like actually fix Igimo tweets out, okay? If y'all didn't watch my previous videos, that's why you need to turn on them damn notice. Mike Wang basically said in uh Iggy stream that they're basically gonna buff yellows to make it easier shooting for all these uh comp players who are shooting on harder settings for it to go in, you know, and uh hopefully get rid of some ghost contest, etc. and all that because they're going to make the shot anyway. But Igimo says, we got to do something about the fact that 620% contestants go in per Pro-Am game. Please, Baluba. I understand letting yellows go in more, but this is too much. And y'all know the contest system is kind of crazy, so it probably really be looking like 50-something. But uh, 
yeah y'all let me know if y'all are noticing this in park etc but yeah this is two top okay one of the accused zenners let's see what he's doing okay this is like the only guy shooting shots like this everybody's accusing him of zenning him and dynasty dynasty kind of isn't doing the same but look y'all see this no one else is shooting like this i know y'all probably see these in uh park and all that again now but people aren't doing this in pro-am and he's doing it very consistently a lot of people think he's cheating y'all let me know what y'all think look stop putting your hand up let's see what he's talking about damn in his mid wow hold on hold on let's see what he's talking about let's see what he's talking about let's see what he's talking about y'all let me know zen or no zen and these are comp players right so y'all know their ratings are crazy he's kind of next to him y'all y'all i know y'all gonna say hand down man down he do got the the damn uh badge but hey it's a, i'm hearing that people aren't really shooting stuff like this man everybody's struggling besides this guy Ooh. And they, they did get a kind of, uh, this is a late contest. Let's see when their hands went up. Yeah, it was already how to, let's, uh, let's do it. 7%. Look, Dynasty, one of the Q Zenners, man. He says they fixed the shooting finally, bro. Okay. Hey, he just said this 30 minutes ago, man. Hey, Zens is back. They got a new script, or y'all think they just buffed the shooting crazy? Y'all let me know how y'all shooting is going, man. Look at this. Please stop jumping now. He's adding them. This is how you got to act with a zen, because it kind of play it off. Look at this. Damn, bro. Damn. Look at this, bro. Look how disrespectful this is. 74, 65. Spin jump shot at the logo what y'all gonna say hand down man down hand down man down damn this hoe contested too damn and that hoe was red and he made that hoe y'all think he's in it <laughs> yeah he's a little toxic bitch. imagine if he's actually zitted like doing this bro like adding these people y'all crazy bro y'all got y'all can't be cheating on the video game you're gonna go to hell bro it's not worth it look put your hand down made a made a red damn bro what's wrong with this dude <laughs> put a hand up please let's see what he got going on <laughs> damn <laughs> damn four people on him damn another red damn <laughs> Y'all think he plugged in? Y'all think he plugged in? <laughs> to not go back court, that's a damn skill. Ooh, damn. Hey man, Zen or no Zen? Bam! <laughs> hey man, I dropped a hilarious wreck video. Y'all go click on the video on the screen to watch it. It is hilarious. Go check it out, man. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. <laughs> We go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.